the old opera house downtown Nacogdoches will present its first annual art exhibition. For this year, Stephen F. Austin will present an SFA grad student art piece, Clean Fields, as her Master of Fine Arts exhibition. This event will showcase an art piece from an exercise found in garden practices. And maybe it might take 18 months to convince the university to do this. This opportunity means more than anything to grad student Lindsey Krill. It's something that I've worked really hard for, but that I also sincerely appreciate that the university is recognizing. Um, and so as far as what it means, we'll see. Um, but I genuinely appreciate it, and I've been working insanely hard uh, to make sure that it's worth it for them and for me. The exhibition entails 17 different pieces with more traditional art mediums like graphite, charcoal, and even plant-based materials that are part of our daily lives, but not necessarily regular drawing tools. Lindsay explains the goal behind her pieces being more than just an inspiration in the garden. My work doesn't, doesn't translate one-to-one, -one, you know, gardening to paper. It's not the kind of floral artwork that you'll find in your grandparents' bathroom, right? Um, since it is part homage and part documentation, um, you know, you'll see organic shapes um, and you'll see, you know, depths of field. There's large scales, there's a lot of different compositions, um, but it doesn't feel as intimidating as maybe some abstract art does um, because it is based on nature. It is loosely observational. Um, so it connects to the garden well, but it's also kind of heady, and it's supposed to be, and it's supposed to be kind of meditative and soothing. As much as of this being an opportunity for Lindsay, it's a door opening for all SFA students. This exhibition can be viewed November 1st through the 18th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. For Backpack Journalism, this is Marno Tang.